at Rankage Brothers with the nephew. His mom and dad are looking at getting a new uh, new trailer. And I'm looking at RVs over here because RVs are the best. So yeah, I'm gonna snoop around and look and see what's here. So this RV is like super nice. And I looked at the price tag. Well, how much was that? $112,000. I don't know how anybody can afford that. Hey, quit. I mean, it's nice and all, but I don't know if I would pay $100,000 for an RV. Because in a couple of years, this thing's going to be like, three th yeah, not 3000 but like 30000 So yeah, let's go look at some other ones. So this one has a slide out right here, which is pretty cool. It makes makes it have quite a bit of room. Stay right there, Jaxie. See, that's quite a bit of room in here, isn't it? It's a lot of room in here, isn't it, baby boy? You're just gonna shoot me, aren't you? Don't shoot me, don't shoot! Please don't shoot me! Ah, you shot me! Ah, ah. You killed me, you done killed me, kid. No, please, ah, you're killing me! Anywho, yeah, so there's a TV up there. Should pull out and I'll just quit playing. Hey, don't mess with anything. Leave it alone. And then you come over here and there's like a little a little hallway. Okay. To the left is the bathroom. Which also goes into the bedroom. That is crazy. And then over here is a door that goes back out to the hallway. This just astounds me, dude. It's astonishing. What do you think, Jax? You gonna buy it for me? This one's only 113,000. Yeah, this behemoth. I don't even know, want to know the price on this guy. What do you think this costs, Jax? How much do you think it costs? It looks expensive, doesn't it? Way above our price range. What are you doing? Yeah, those stairs come down when you open the door. Just leave that alone, okay? So we're looking at that massive one I just showed you. And it's it's big in here. It has like a almost a full-size kitchen. And then the bed in here is insane. Look at that. It's huge. And then inside this little cupboard here is a friggin' washer and a dryer. It's a washer-dryer combo. That is cool. Definitely out of my price range. I don't even want to see the sticker. I, I don't even see anything that has a price on it in here, so I'm not asking because it's going to be ridiculously expensive. Also, these chairs, super soft and comfortable. Must be made of Corinthian leather. You can see yourself in the big mirror, can't you, buddy? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Look at it. It's a big mirror. Wave. Say hello. <laughs> run, baby, run. <laughs> Looking at the trailer again. Uh, yeah, it's real interesting. Real super interesting. Uh, yeah, super interesting. The RVs are still better. Yeah, so after that, we kind of we went out and had uh, dinner as a family. Went to Cracker Barrel. Real classy. Real classy. If you got a problem with it, bring it up with me. We can fight, wrestle, mud wrestle, tickle each other. I don't know. We'll get it figured out. But yeah, we went and had dinner. And then uh, after that, just went home and that's not much, you know, not much happened after that. It's kind of a calm, quiet day as well as yesterday. And I have a cute kitty right here to snuggle with. 
It's just so cute. So hi. Meow. Yeah, the lighting's kind of weird because I have my laptop and really no light in here right now anyways. Um, but yeah, so we didn't, didn't do much. I uh, just kind of hung around. It's pretty cool looking at RVs. It makes me really want to get one and do the full-time RV life as a lot of pe as a lot as a lot of people call it. So, uh, yeah, they're pretty expensive unless you get like a used one. Those were all like brand new, like 2016 models and that. They were pretty cool. They were neat. Um, but yeah, I wanted to like talk about something real quick too. Like, just <laughs> you're shedding everywhere, cat. You shed everywhere, dude. You know that. You shed everywhere. It's okay because you're adorable, so I like you. I just wanted to talk about, like, people just, you know, bra or, like, not bragging, but just, you know, talking crap about, like, your ideas of wanting to do stuff, wanting to do something with your life, your ideas, if it doesn't, you know, fit to the social norm. How, like... I, it's just frustrating because what is normal nowadays, you know, like, it's, I don't know, uh, another thing was like talking about me playing drums and somebody was like, oh yeah, you know, can you make money doing it? I was like, yeah, probably not, you know, well, realistically, just being honest, just, I mean, if something happens, that'd be cool to make money playing drums in a band, dude, awesome, that'd be pretty cool. But, you know, realistically, you're, you're not going to make a whole lot, you know, like, because I'm probably not going to become a professional musician. I definitely probably won't achieve that in my lifetime. Um, but, yeah, just the person was like, oh, so you're not going to make any money doing it. No, nope, it's just for fun. Then why are you doing it? Why don't I do it? It's a, it's a hobby. It's something fun I like to do. Why do, why do you got to rain on it? Do I talk about bad about your enjoyments and your hobbies, I don't, you know, I support you and your ventures, and this is definitely not, this is, somebody that was saying this definitely is never going to watch this, and if they do, whatever, I don't care, but it's no one that is currently watching, I guess I should say, but I'm not going to name them, because it's just, it's not right to, you know, call somebody out on the internet and they can't really defend themselves, because they won't watch the video. But yeah, it's just, it's frustrating. And I'm kind of doing this because there's an idea CT had, and like just talking about a topic, even if it's just something uh, that I want to talk about. And if anybody does watch it, feel free to give me some ideas or something you want me to talk about or you want to see my beliefs on. You know, it, it could be, you know, kind of a fun thing or not, or cause some controversy, which makes life interesting. No. Controversy sucks. Drama. I hate drama pages on YouTube. Ridiculous. But anywho, I need to get going. Um, I got a kitty here that wants to snuggle and cuddle because she's needy. Like, all the time. Like, 100% needy. All the time. And, uh, so yeah. And, as CT wants me to start saying, y'all gonna get out of my woods now. You hear?